Good afternoon. I don't know if you could hear or not. I am completely plugged up. I am, this is now two weeks I've been dealing with whatever cold or, or whatever it is. And it, uh, man, it hit me last week and it hit me fast and it hit me hard. And where I'm at right now, this ear is completely plugged up. I can't hear anything out of it. It, it just feels like I have an ear plug in. So I hear all that extra noise in my head. A uh, little bit of a sore throat, a lot of drainage, just a lot of issues. Um, getting some of my strength back, thankfully. Uh, I don't know if I'm yelling right now because I can't, I can't tell, but I'm starting to slowly get my voice back. Um, I got my microwave going here. It's gonna beep in a second, there we go. Uh, I'm making some hot tea. It's uh, throat comfort from Yogi. It was uh, wild cherry bark and orange peel is the uh, the flavoring of of that. So I'm warming up some water now. But it, like I said, it has been two weeks now. What's today? Tuesday. Two weeks tomorrow, technically. It'll be exactly two weeks tomorrow uh, that I've been dealing with this, and I've, I'm not happy about it. I've been taking cough I got cough drops I've got medicine uh you know I've been trying to do everything that I can uh without taking a whole lot of medicine and stuff because I I hate doing that um been taking Advil just for the body aches and everything but enough of all of that what we're gonna do now since I haven't really been able to film because I've been sick and I've been trying to get over this um I don't have my voice for long so um i am going to just show you some extra footage that did not make it into any of the videos and uh, let me know what you think i am going to try to work on getting some more videos out at some point here soon but like i said i have had no strength to be able to do any of that and uh it's been it's been just killing me uh i was home for the weekend and i really just didn't get a whole lot done i i've I had to take Advil PM just to sleep and it was a whole nightmare. But regardless, check this footage out. This is just extra stuff that never made it into certain videos. Uh, I've said this before and a lot of uh, other YouTubers understand this. Like you'll film an entire day and have to crunch that down into like a half hour video at most. Um, so it's bound to happen that you're gonna have extra stuff and uh, this is part of it. So go ahead and check that out and uh, Hopefully I'll be feeling better soon and I can get back to uh, trying to film on somewhat of a regular basis. So, enjoy. Well, good morning. We're here in Milwaukee at uh, Crete, getting the truck some service. I'm gonna grab some coffee here since it was offered to me. Just a little coffee set up here, sugar. I am actually all um, set up here at the table, getting some editing done. Current time is about 10 a.m. up here, so that's not too bad. This is just regular old Kramer, isn't it? Yeah, just original. Oh well, can't complain too much, right? Free coffee, what are you gonna do? But um, yeah, the truck's in the shop right now because uh, I had a PM done yesterday at Risinger and there was a whole bunch of dash lights on from the week before. I don't think I got to show that on camera yet, but uh, I cannot open this Kramer and hold the camera. There we go. Um, all these dash lights came on and it was a bit of an issue, but regardless, they weren't able to do anything about it. So I spent the night at Risinger, three o'clock this morning, I took off, uh, took a load to Pleasant Prairie from Risinger and uh, bobtailed up here and now they're working on the truck I'm hanging out in here I don't know how long it's gonna be uh, they pulled it in before I walked in here which was not that long ago but um, either way we'll see how it goes I'm just uh, hoping for a quick turn here and we can get back on the road I can show you what it looks outside out the window there I feel like I'm walking around like I own the place it's kind of weird. I wonder if I could just open these here if they wouldn't mind. 
you see out there? It's a little icy. And it's supposed to rain. So, I don't know. We'll see. But I'm going to pour some coffee. I'm going to get in with this editing and uh, see what we can come up with today. Hopefully, I can salvage some miles this week. Uh, I think right now I'm only at like 2,000 miles. And uh, I, would, I wanted to be around 3,000. So, I don't think it's going to happen. Today's Wednesday. Today's probably going to be shot, honestly. But we'll see. See what we can come up with. But first, coffee. Now, how much you want to bet? As soon as I start to clean this window here, they're going to send the trailer number. How much you want to bet? Oh well. Lower it down a little bit so we can get up to the top there. Try not to get any on the camera. Of course, you might need a little. Yeah. Just start cleaning this window here. It's always important to keep a clean truck. Clean windows, clean everything. If anything happens and I ever go to a shop, I want the truck to be clean. I want them to know that this is a, uh, a clean truck, that I care about it. I, I try to take care of it. Make a $675 a week payment on it. I'm going to take care of it. I'm going to take care of it. Like I was saying earlier about that bunk, I still got the plastic on it. I have no intentions of taking that off. Man, this stuff smells great. Tastes, tastes great too, actually. I don't know. Might have to take a swig of that stuff at some point here. That'll, that'll wake you up, won't it? I'm sure there's a lot of stuff in that that uh, DOT would not like. Like what though, really? I mean, what's in glass cleaner? In case of eye or skin contact, flush with water for 15 minutes. I could spare 15 minutes. If irritation persists, see a physician. If swallowed, do not induce vomiting. Well, I don't know about that. Never mind. All right, squeaky clean, my man. Squeaky clean. At least on this side. The outside's got a little stuff on it, but... Hey, look at that. They didn't send the trailer. Didn't get any numbers yet. That's all right. That's all right. Or, if I start the next window, they'll probably send it then. But I'm not going to... I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna risk it. That's much better. Man. Sometimes I drive with my window down so I can hear. And uh, rain and slush and stuff comes in sometimes and it gets all over me and it'll hit the inside of the windshield. Windshield? Window. The winder. I love Wisconsin. It's a beautiful state. It's just, especially in the nice weather, especially in the nice weather, it is nice. I really like it. And coming to U-Lines, they're usually just great because they really take care of the place. Nice, clean buildings. They spend a lot of time and money on their landscaping. Man, summertime, I swear, they mow that grass seven days a week. Every day that grass is getting mowed. They're out there spraying the weed killer and they're they're planting trees and, and tying them with the strings to hold them upright and everything. And they're always blowing leaves and just everything. They take good care of the place. They definitely do. All right, we're all loaded and ready to go. Trailer 918. Let's go to Allentown. 